Today on the Road Hard Roadhouse, we're going over this Fusion Satin Black spray paint. You get it at Walmart, it's like $4 and something cents. If you try to get it at some of the uh, box stores or the uh, auto parts stores, you're going to pay close to $8. So go to get it at Walmart. It's a really good deal. Now why I'm doing this today is because a lot I deal with muscle cars. And a lot of the engine bays on Chevrolets were a satin type black. And this is almost an exact match. I can't even really tell the difference between the old school original engine bays and this satin black. So let's get this thing started. I do want to say before we get it started that I am sponsored by Speedy's Industrial Coatings. They do media blasting, powder coating, big or small, they do it all. Let's get it started. I really like the satin black on this Fusion because it looks like the old muscle car um, like engine bays and that type of stuff. And that's really what I'm using it for on my uh, 1970 Nova Super Sport. Covers well and has a really nice finish. We'll see what it looks like when it's dry. The Fusion Satin Black puts a professional type finish on there. And as you can see, I've used a lot of it. Even on my hood hinges. But I just painted these a few minutes ago. And a little dust from painting them outside. But other than that, they look really, really, really good. Here's a little experiment I did with a uh, radiator spacer from a 67 Impala. Um, I did this with the gloss black fusion paint and then I laid it out in the sun for the last, uh, I guess, month, month and a half. And it really hasn't done anything at all. It hasn't faded or any of that type of stuff whatsoever at all. So uh, from what I can see here, um, you know, I didn't, it got rained on, it got... Uh, sat in the sun uh, over the summer so and I just leaned it up against a pole so it didn't uh, it was exposed to all the elements and it did a really good job of keeping the the gloss paint now when I painted this thing I did not sand it down I just threw paint on top of the surface rust that was on this thing and it looks really good for what it's for what it was If you're looking for a satin style paint, I would really give this Krylon Fusion a try. I am not paid by Krylon whatsoever at all, but I will tell you, I have been using their products on this, uh, as far as this Fusion goes, and I'm really proud of it. Now, as far as um, in the future, I think I said in another video, I will be using this stuff on engine bays and that type of stuff. Um, the gloss black, which I used on some brake parts on a International Scout, I have a video for that. Um, but the parts came out looking like they were, um, not powder coated, but they did look like they were coat, uh, coated pretty good in that stuff. So I appreciate everybody for watching, like, and subscribe. And as always, if you ride her hard, don't put her up wet. When you put her up wet, you gotta use stuff like this. Appreciate it.